These countries will soon be brought to its knees, my people. Soon this country will lament the passing of its people. My people, you will start to awaken when a loss occurs. You'll be taken off guard during this difficult period. Prepare. Get ready now since the hour is drawing near. Your time has come for divine mercy and justice to manifest. Shalom, my Christian brothers and sisters around the world. God has given us the blessing of yet another new day, a joyful heart and mind, a blissful spirit, and a good time to memorize. Allow Christ's light to illuminate you and enlighten every step you take and every moment of darkness, and let yourself be taken over by the light of Christ and spread that light wherever you go. Today, let us share with you some words from Our Lady of Medjugorje in the message to Jennifer, an American visionary. Before we proceed to the core of the message, may you not forget to like this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel so as to be able to access the latest messages from above. Stay with us and listen to this video until the very end. God has a blessing with your name on it. Type Amen if you believe so and praise be to God. Here comes the message of Our Lady of Medjugorje. Together, we listen to it together and preserve the holiness of peace, which is beyond all insight and protects our heart, mind, and soul. I am coming to you from the holy Medjugorje, my children, especially to those who have not yet experienced my son's love, in accordance with his will and my maternal love. You who consider me and invoke me, I am coming to you. I'm sending you my motherly affection and the blessing of my son. Do you see the gifts, the indications of my presence and affection? Do you have pure and be ready to open hearts? My children, this earth has started to tilt, and it is no longer rotating around the sun because a world that has so voluntarily turned against its creator is still shrouded in the darkness of sin. Darkness has enveloped those who think they are above the rest of humanity. You will gain favor with my son in heaven if you have a humble spirit. Your time has come, my people, and it is coming to an end. Accept my words and do not dismiss them, because the gospel is the only way for anybody to find brightness of my kingdom. Your hardships and sufferings will appear as the hours pass one after the other. You have this time, so start getting ready, for until the life of my small ones is allowed, mankind will not experience peace. Repent, children, repent, for I continue to be pierced by your transgressions. Your selfishness and laziness earn you the fires of hell rather than the rewards of the kingdom. Do not squander this opportunity, since the end is near and the devil is after your soul. Because this is the final round of the conflict, and it has only just begun, Satan and his numerous evil spirits will unleash an even larger battle. Many countries, including the USA and its allies, will have to face great suffering at the moment when they least expect and prepare. When this moment comes, your financial institutions will shut down as you see someone who has chosen to lead collapse. Nation will rise up against nation, yet this earth is being purified of its impurities by all of this carnage. For all of mankind to understand that my son is the genuine Messiah, I will come and purge those of my sons chosen who have abandoned their calling, and I will shed even more light on those who remain true to the cross and are prepared to suffer martyrdom for expressing the truth. The wounds that have been added to my most sacred hearts will be visible to everyone. Until humanity is returned to as I intended it to be, this earth won't be at peace. Because everyone will be held accountable at their hour of judgment, you must not go before your master. It is crucial that they are dedicated to my most sacred heart.
My places of refuge are being prepared all across the world. Because so many sinners are unaware of the awakening they will experience, it is imperative that my faithful pray for their conversion on a daily basis. Prepare, my people, get ready because this world is about to awaken. You do not yet know the time because I am Jesus and my mercy and justice will triumph, but the day will come. You'll start to see significantly more separation between your brothers and sisters. Even more difficulties will befall you, and you'll start to understand that I am the source of all your needs. My children, my son in heaven has given you everything a man could possibly need to survive. Man will gather the earth's natural resources in order to complete his task. My people, pay attention to and pay attention to the gospel message because it is the only way you will approach the kingdom. A stronger sign is coming out of the east with the light that has just started to appear on the horizon. Pay attention and follow the commandments since you are the ones who deny your own areas of weakness by spending time condemning others. My people, pay attention to the condition of your souls because none of you are sinless. No one among you should use their mouth to disparage another. Start sharing the gospel right now by being a living example of it. Move forward, my people, for the ascent and fall of the leader who has been appointed is drawing near. This earth will be covered in rings of fire, and the regions that have reaped the rewards of such iniquity will burn up like ashes as these things I have spoken of come to pass." Repent and hold fast to the cross rather than joining the ignorant and sinful group. Don't give Satan your soul, which is not his. You are my children, born out of my love, and I am your mother. Be my light in the world, and you will receive a huge recompense in the divine kingdom. Go now, because I am your mother, and be at peace. I will bring about justice and mercy. Your mother loves you. This is the end of today's message. Stay blessed, keep praying, and spread the word about this video till we see each other again. We pray that God will keep bestowing his favors and blessings onto us. Finally, pray for the USA and its allies.